It's God's Spirit that's gathered us. You know, a little bit with uncertainty, sort of emerging, kind of, from COVID. Not quite, not yet. So we live in this uncertain time. And it's in the midst of this that God gathers us, as God has done down through the ages. Always gathering Christians in the most difficult times and gathering them around this, the story, the Christian story that is our origin, our identity. That he's saying to you from the beginning that he is all in. And the invitation for us is to let him in, to allow him to wash our feet. And as we went through the stations of the cross today, as we reflected upon what happened to Jesus in a very physical way, very visceral way, it's hard not to be moved in the depths of our being. It's not so much about what happened to Jesus physically, but what was in his heart for humanity. Christians down through the generations have looked upon the cross, have looked upon the cross of Jesus. Because there is our life, there is our origin, there is our identity from the side of Christ. to move your body than to have a good dance. So guys, right here, right now, we're gonna dance. We're gonna just Just dance. dance! Let's get up. So now we're going to light the candle. Christ yesterday and today, the beginning and the end. And all the people said, Amen. Amen. We've been baptized into the death and resurrection of Jesus. There's no reason why we need to be defeated. He's given us the victory. We, we have to claim it though in faith. So I'm saying to you, Christ is risen. Are you sure? Christ is risen. Amen. My daughter got baptized last night. That's so. And if I'm being honest, part of me would rather stay here on this mountaintop, stay here in this moment, because I know when I leave here, I'm going to be spending a lot of time guarding the flame, hoping that it won't go out. You know, Father Ken lit the, uh, the Paschal candle last night. No, what did he do? He took the light he was given and he risked it to share it. This is the purpose of God. He wants us to become a light to the nations. 